Who survived now live in small enclaves separated by vast dangerous stretches of land the only means of contact between distant human settlements are lone individuals brave or desperate enough to travel on their own across dangerous wastelands they are known as pilgrims somewhere on the map one city is still standing a city isolated from the outside world a city with special rules. A city that had to sacrifice nearly everything to remain standing. Now, it's the last bastion of humanity. A chance for us to learn from history. And for once, make the right choices. It's a place where the fate of mankind will soon be decided. Because every choice you make here shapes the future. Irreversibly. used to be more fun. <laughs> you used to be younger. And dumber. What matters is, you're still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim... Yeah, a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. See you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. <laughs> but don't get all mushy on me now. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? <laughs> Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. While you've been kicking around for, what, four years now? <laughs> and you're still alive? So are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, the trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Look, Aiden. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste, can we? Uh, no way. Look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here, too.
You remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village? Oh, yeah, the one that had that saying. Uh, remember, chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving. Combine them and lucky you. You might just go on living. Come on, we're almost there. This is it. Come on. Wow. Hmm. Somebody had a nice crib. Damn it. Locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. If those were the worst problems back in the day, I... Party? Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. Uh, nothing here. in here. What the? Hey, everything all right? Yeah, just rats. I think it's time we parted ways. Why? I'm starting to worry about you, and you know our saying. If you're starting to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. Empty. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Who do you voodoo? Hmm. Sounds familiar. Not a zip. And that's what they called art?
There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. They died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky, too. Hey, I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. She was classy. Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Aiden, come here. Check this out. Sit down, buddy. For you. A gift? A gift from the heavens, to be more accurate. I've just found it, by the owner's dead body. May it be you, more use to you. Here. It's gone flat. <laughs> Look at you and your sophisticated palate. Who would have thought the end of the world could be so peaceful? Yeah, at least until night falls. True. I wish Crane could have seen this. Uh, who? Doesn't matter. I tracked down that guy for you. Hey, what, what, what guy? Quit pretending. You became a pilgrim to track that fuck. Hey, what? And you're only telling me... Huh, when I tossed you a beer, thought you guessed the guy's in Villador. Supposedly he knows something about Waltz. Villador. I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary? It's on your way. People don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. Boom, something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected. And suddenly, they're knocking on our doors. All right. Uh, not just one. So what about that guy? He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the... He'll be listening for... Told him he'd hear from you soon. What does he want in return? <laughs> I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about it. Hey, hey, hey. And she's always getting... <laughs> sort of talk. I'd... Never heard anyone get so... Because you don't... Yeah, you're probably right. I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're gonna live there. No one's gonna drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will yeah. you tell me sometime? Yeah, one day. Well, so when my will time's I see you up. again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy. Or whoever you're looking for. And remember, 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you.
Almost there. <clears throat> uh. 
Oh, it's already dark. It's time to hide somewhere for the night. I won't get any better than this. Someone moved them. Not long ago. It's been moved. Okay, let's give it a try. Well, this is it. The broadcast station. I gotta start the generator. Ugh. <sighs> 
the beta? Are we running or what? But, like, now? No, when we're <laughs> old. Now, 80. We need supplies. It's so quiet. Where is everyone? Maybe they're all dead. <laughs> You're stupid. Let's go. Now. Shh. It'll be all right. Wait here. Nothing good will come of this. Have you brought 12346? We were supposed to take the patients back to the city. Don't worry. They'll let us go soon. I'm scared. I'm here with you. You're safe with me. find each other. Time to contact the guy Spike was talking about. This is Aiden. Anyone out there looking for me? Well, there's no water. But you checked the Killians? Don't give me that shit. I'm sick of it. Hello, this is Aiden. A pilgrim. I'm waiting for contact. Over. This is Aiden. I'm on frequency 140.200 megahertz. Hello? Aiden? Yes. I was supposed to get in touch with you. Thought you changed your mind. Why are you looking for Waltz, Pilgrim? To find someone else. Her name is Mia. Fifteen years ago, we were in a hospital together and... I know who you're looking for, Aiden. 
You want to know why Waltz was doing those experiments on all of you. Why you are stronger, more durable than others. Now, I just want to find Mia. I've been looking for her since I left the survivor's camp. I, can you help me or not? Maybe I can. Let's meet, Pilgrim. Where and when? Entrance to the metro tunnel by the bay. You can get inside the tunnel through an open GRE hatch. I'll meet you there. I take it you're not doing this for free. I have to leave the city, but I won't make it on my own outside. Take me to New Paris and we're even. Along the way, I'll tell you everything I know. Over and out. Wait. I have to at least know if she's alive. She's alive. I'm going to the rendezvous. I'll see you later, Aiden. Well, at least I didn't have to climb to the top of this antenna. Hello? It's Aiden. Can you hear me now? Loud and clear. That means you must be close. I swam across the lake. So you've almost reached the tunnels. There's an entrance. The only one the GRE left when they sailed out the city. I'm coming from the other side. Hurry up. <clears throat> What's wrong? I'm entering the tunnels. Hey, can you hear me? I'll meet you soon. Here I come. Hey, is anybody there?
Are you all right? You fucker bit me. A volatile. Lots of those fuckers in the sewers. We must get into the light quickly. Where's me up? Uh, later. We have to move. <laughs> Resist it. It'll pass. <laughs> Just stay strong. Here you are. We've been looking for you. <laughs> and what about this one? Uh, seems dead to me. Didn't have it on him. Let's go! I don't have the key. I swear! I did this on my own. <clears throat> Both of you able to get it. I don't know what you're talking about. Let him go. You're gonna make us let him go, punk? I'd sure like to see you do that. Bring it! Who's that? There's no time. In my pocket. I left you something. What is this? A GRE access key. The peacekeepers, they found it. We cannot you're gonna tell me what happened to my lose sister. it. Where's Mia? You will go to Fish Eye. There, ask for a girl named Lawan. Give that to her. With it, and her help, you'll learn. You will learn everything. Understand? Protect it. If Waltz gets his hands on it, the whole city, everyone Walt. will die. Is Waltz here? He is. Oh, they're coming. You hear that? Renegades, run. We'll go together. Take this. Hey, let's go. What the fuck? There's our lost lamb. He's not alone. We 
have to run. Let's get the fuck out. Tahir, are you there? Do you have my key? It's Walt. We have to run. But I'm looking for him. You we... idiot. He'll kill you if he finds you. Dylan! Fuck. Get to the vent. Quick. This way. You first. What are you doing? Waltz can't get the GRE key, remember? What? Let me out! Fish high. The one. Go! Damn the traitor! Let him go. Why did you betray me? This key is not yours. You can't... Where is it? I'm sorry. <sighs> Getting misty? Not really. You're only dying. Before zero hour, my grandfather raised horses. Beautiful rare breeds. I love them dearly. One day his most beloved horse fell off the slope and broke his leg. I thought Grandpa would help him. But he just pulled out his pistol and put it in my hand. He told me, you're doing it for him. Then he pressed my finger on the trigger. I screamed. I wanted my grandfather to die. But years later I realized, what must be done, must be done. You leave me no choice, my friend. Someone's here. happening. 